Hey guys, Shifty here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Ultra Sun. Now, in the last episode, we we did something. I don't remember. Again, it's been a week since I recorded this, because I'm recording this on a Friday, pushing it to the very last minute, because that's just the Shifty way. You feel me? Sorry about that. I had to stop for just a second, just a second. But we're here. The team's looking good. I don't remember if I had this team before the last episode or not, but I have... Um, Sceptile, Geico, Flamethrower, Oblivion Wing, Nasty Plot, Flutter Cannon, Insane Moveset, Metal Gear with uh, Gear Grind, Thousand Ways, Screech, Automatize, Automize, whatever the hell. Wayne's here. Uh, Arcaps is here with Acrobats, Rock Slide, Woodhammer, U Turn, Dry Skin, which is a great ability for this thing. Um, genuinely, I don't remember what happened last episode. I think. No, I hadn't lost Pokemon in those. So I might have just done this team recap for nothing, but you can still see the team. It's a good-looking team. The team's looking quite strong. Quite strong. And that's all that really matters. Now, where the hell do I go is the real question, because I don't remember. Okay, I don't care, Rotom. Let me see. Where's the fucking... Where am I going? Thank you, thank you. I'm trying to see the goddamn map, and he's talking to me about whatever the hell. I'm like, bro, I don't fucking care. Alright, let's see. Let's see if I can regain, um, how- if the knowledge to play this game, because genuinely my brain is just not working at the moment. I just had to deal with, um, Citra, the emulator- I, I mean, not emulator, the completely legal 3DS that I'm using, just not working for some reason, so that was pretty cool. Also. Yeah, just- just one more thing. Huh. Weird. Alright, nothing's going on. Nothing's going on. What are we doing? Oh yeah, we were here with Lily, and she was like, Oh, the vast Pony Canyon. But I was like, hell no, I'm not doing that shit. Now it's coming back to me. Genuinely, every time I boot up this game, it's just trying to remember what happened last week. Which is something I am just not good at. So, here we are. But I think we get to fight... Um, either... No, we're, I don't think we fight Hapu here. I think we fight the um, Ultra Recon Squad. I think we fight them here, and then continue on with the Fast Pony Canyon and stuff. Also, I hit 200 subscribers today, so can we get a clap in the uh, in the comments for me hitting 200 subscribers? This was a very PogChamp day, very PogChamp moment, and since I'm in the middle of this, and me and JP might be doing more Master Duel content, and then me and JP are also continuing our collabs, um, I'm not going to do like a dedicated... 200 sub celebration series like right now because I just got too much other shit going on. So the next series will be a 200 subscriber special and um, it's gonna be something. It's gonna be something. Um, I think I have an idea of what I want it to be but I'm not sure. So we will we will see. We will see. But that's all I'm gonna give away. Um, it's kind of a 200 subscriber special. But also it's not, because I don't think you guys have requested the game or anything like that, so... You know, it's... Kind of... It's kind of... Something, but kind of not. You get me? You guys get it. I'm sure you get it. You guys are smart. You get it. Also, there's a question on day on the screen in bold black text. And it's something along the lines of, do you like going to a theater? Or do you like watching a movie at home? Now, me personally, I cannot weigh in on this, because... I've been to the movie theaters, like, twice in my lifetime. Genuinely, I mean that. I think, no, three times. I've been three times in my life. When I was little and Nemo had just come out, uh, my, my mom took me to watch Nemo. And I went for, like, a school field trip a time or two to see, I think it was, like, a Percy Jackson movie or something. And the last was seeing Big Hero 6 in theaters. Those those have been my three uh, theater experiences, and honestly, I don't really give a shit about any of them. <laughs> so, yeah, that's that's my take. Um, I'd honestly prefer to just be at home, because I just like being home generally. Um, and, like, with streaming, the movie comes out, like, the next week after theaters, so it doesn't really matter. So yeah, I think I'd rather just, um, rather just do that. 
Um, I don't want to stay in. I know I resist normal type moves, but I'm so scared of using Archeops at any point. Because it's so fucking frail. It just genuinely scares me, because I want this thing to stay until the Elite Four. So I want to just keep it safe. Forever. Like, I don't know if he's eating a Hyper Voice like that. Let's see, let's go for a little... God, I forgot your moveset fucking sucks. Go for a little Thunder Punch, I guess. Other than that, uh, how's it going? You know? How's it going? You feel me? What's up? Alright. You know what? It's now or never with Archeops. If I'm not gonna use him now. No, I'm just gonna U-turn. I'm too pussy. I'm too pussy. I'm too pussy to use him. This, this x is fucking me up, and so is the fucking lag. This is lagging more than usual, which is which is odd. Uh, like I said, I was having Citra Troubles beforehand, so maybe that's why, but... As far as I can tell, it's no different than, uh... Like, the regular setup. So set to the most dog shit quality possible. And shit, so I'm not sure. Like, it definitely seems worse than usual, which is saying something. And we're back. Sorry, I was playing with settings, and they were, like, going through a dialogue thing that I didn't care about. So I just cut it out. But, how's it going, guys? How's it going? I hit 200 subscribers today, like I said. That's pretty cool. New series coming after this that, um, I literally just had the idea to do, like, today. Like, I've been wanting to play the game for a while, but not in the style if that makes sense, like the, the lock type. So, we'll see how it goes. I think it shouldn't be too hard to do, in my opinion, because, you know, I'm kind of the goat when it comes to Pokemon. But, you know, things could change. Yo, old Lantern! That's just what I wanted for this encounter, actually. How did the game know that I wanted a Lantern? Let's see. I'll toss a, I'll toss a Safari Ball. Hopefully this just catches. I don't want to have to, like, deal with this thing. Oh, come on, man. Discharge. You're so, you're so petty. Oh, and the paralysis and the paralysis. Yeah, you really needed that, bro. <laughs> you know what, fucking, I'm gonna flirt cannon. If it lives it, we can catch it. If it dies, it dies. That's where I'm at right now. Because I really don't need a lantern, to be honest, but... Oh, that did fucking nothing. Jesus Christ. Yo, this subtitle fucking sucks. Let's go up to Metal Gear, weaken it, and then catch it. Why not? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Fucking lantern. Fucking lantern. Weird ass Pokemon. Just, just a real goofy looking guy. Real goofy goober. Oh, it died. Oh no. I'm so sad. Fuck lantern. Fuck Lantern on God. Um. Oh wait, doesn't Lily heal me out here? Lily, please. Come to my rescue. I need to be healed. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it, Lily. Alright, now let's take on this fucking... Joe Schmo. See what he's got. He's, he's got nothing on my team. My team's just better. Truthfully. Nothing's coming close to my team. Alright, you know, a Heatran... Pretty good. I will admit it. Heatran's pretty good. Definitely don't want to stay in. Um, I definitely... Definitely know who to go out to here. And I think... I'm thinking Zinx. I think Zinx is the play. Flying Stab should be pretty good. Scary face, that's fine. As long as we don't get, like, burnt or something, then I think we should be fine. I don't think Heatran has anything especially crazy for Zinx. Also, these levels are, like, right on par with us, which is terrifying. Oh, a flinch? Nice. A nice flinch, asshole. God, I hate Pokemon sometimes. The fucking RNG is insane. Again. If it gets it three times in a row, I genuinely have to think it's Serene Grace. Fucked up. Also, make sure you're staying hydrated out here. Get a nice good drink of water. 
God, Heatran is such a fucking stupid Pokemon. Why are you so bulky? Okay, there we go. Thankfully, we didn't get flinched a second time. Fucking 1% chance of happening. Get flinched back to back by Fire Fang. Stupid ass Pokemon. Um, I'm just going Dwayne here on the Pidgeot. I don't care if it's a Mega or not. Pidgeot. Not just regular old Pidgeot. Regular old lame ass bird. Probably the worst of the uh, the regional birds. If I had to, if I had to give him a quick ranking, which I won't because I'm going to save that for content at some point. Um, yeah, no, it's definitely it's definitely bottom tier. It's not that good. Feather Dance? Oh wow, real original. Lowering my attack so you can almost live a hit if you weren't at like two HP. Innards out. Oh thank God. If I had wait, innards out. I think. Innards Out works if it deals the amount of HP you had left directly to the other Pokemon. So if I had o code it with um, Rock Blast, I think it would have done all of Pidgeot's HP to Dwayne. Which, I don't know if it would have killed, but it definitely definitely didn't want that to happen. So honestly, thank god we got uh, three hits of Rock Blast. Yo, an old Amber. I don't... Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe it'll be helpful. Uh, I know we revived some fossils earlier in the series. I don't think we ever revived an old Amber, though. I could be incorrect about that, but who knows? Who knows? I sure as hell don't. Let me just come in here. Let me see if I can sneak past this lady. Excuse me. Don't notice the... God damn it. Tauros, your fucking big ass hitbox got me caught on the on the stone there. Piece of shit. Piece of shit dog ass Pokemon. Yo, Megalodios. It's a really cool Pokemon, man. Grassy Surge. Interesting. Gonna be healing me. Do appreciate that. I'll be honest. I'm just gonna nasty plot up. I don't think this thing one shots me. And then I'm gonna flirt cannon twice. And it'll definitely be dead. Zen Headbutt? That's fine. Alright, it does do a little bit of damage. It does do a little bit of damage, but we got healed, so... I'll run it. I'll, I'll bet that a plus two Flur Cannon kills. I'll risk Geico's life for no reason. Yeah, there we go. That was such, that was such a stupid play, because it did over half. I was almost guaranteed dead there if uh, Flur Cannon didn't kill him and went for Zen Headbutt again. Or, God forbid, a stronger move. So I was really just banking on, on that shit, uh, killing, which, you know, it did. And I had faith in my Pokemon, and that's what makes me so good at the game, is that I just simply believe in my Pokemon, and I accidentally got into a double battle, son of a fucking bitch. Now the, now the video's gonna be like three times as long, because there's two Pokemon on screen, or two more Pokemon on screen now. This is so fucked up. Also, fucking Mega Blaziken is such a such a stupid fucking Pokemon, and I really don't want to have to fight it right now. So I'm definitely switching out both of my Pokemon to Dragon and Dwayne. I think that's the Shmoof. I think Dwayne and Dragon are the Shmoofment. They both... Well, I know Dragon resists fire. I'm not sure about the other one. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, from the AI's perspective, it might fighting move into Metal Gear slot, and that would be Dwayne, and that would be ouchy. That would be ouchy not good. So, perhaps a questionable play has been made. But I also wasn't thinking straight, so. Okay, no, just set up, went for focus energy. Arguably worse, some might say. Some might say that's worse. I might be, I might be the one saying that. Uh, super effective on Blaziken because it's part flying type, and then I'm just gonna straight up rock blast into Blaziken. Shaman is a non-factor right now. You can set up Leech Seed all you want, big bro. That shit is not saving you. Dwayne was seated, literally no problem. What was that? Slash? That's just gonna be like a guaranteed crit then, right? Yeah, and it didn't even do half. Kinda dog shit. Maybe maybe I'm overhyping Mega Blaze again. Cause it is dead to one flying press from my our dragon. 
you know what, maybe adaptability is just a good ability. You know, let me be the first to say it. Maybe, maybe your moves gaining double their power is a good thing. Yeah, and then you're gonna heal. You really had to leave seed just to make this animation just a bit longer, even with the lag, just a bit longer. Just to suck a little more joy out of my soul. Fucking sucks. Alright, we're just flying press again because it's still super effective. <laughs> as funny as it would be to explosion, it doesn't do us any favors. Alright, now we get to slowly watch this animation take place. So how's it going, guys? Tell me about your day. Because I've had a pretty awesome day. I ate chili for lunch. That, was, that shit was fucking good as hell. And then I just chilled, watched some YouTube, talked to JP about shit. Um, what else did I do? I played a little bit of Master Duel before this. Um, I am becoming Yu-Gi-Oh! Pills. I am proud to say it. And today, or yesterday rather, the, uh, the first Master Duel video went up and you guys seem to enjoy it. Uh, it's got 10 views, which is pretty good as far as, you know, views go for me. So... I'm glad you guys enjoyed it, and hopefully I can bring you guys more Master Rule content with and maybe even without JP. I know it's crazy to say, you know, I'm going to do something without JP, but, you know, I'm kind of feeling the Master Rule. And, uh, <laughs> and JP, I was like, yo, what are you doing? Are you trying to play some Master Rule right now? Or something along those lines. And he's like, I haven't opened it up since we recorded that, uh, that video. Or videos, rather. Because he has his own. And I was like, damn, for real? That's crazy, I have like four different decks built. And he's like, well, I didn't want to, you know, invest into it too much if the video flopped. Because he's so, he's so content-brained that he can't enjoy some Yu-Gi-Oh with his friend if it's not for content. Which I get. But, so, that happened, and I was like, okay, that, that's, that's funny, I guess. So I was really hoping the, uh, the Master Duel videos do well, because... I'm going to be playing Master Duel with or without him, and it'd just be it'd just be more fun to have him along for some of the content. So I have a lot of different decks in mind uh, for content. So hopefully, you guys go over there and make sure to watch JP's Master Duel videos, so that he'll be like, oh, yo, these are doing great, we should do this more often. So, that's about where I'm at. Um... Oh, that's cool. I wish I could have had that as my encounter. But no, fuck me. Um, let's see. What else? There's something else I was going to talk about. Or try to talk about. Because I... I don't know. I feel like every time I... The first episode of the weekend always feels a bit... A bit fucked up. Just because I'm trying to get back into, like... Recording. Especially because... Um... Cage Lock is over for me and JP. It's not over for you guys. There's still... Uh, one more video by the time you're seeing this. But, yeah, no, it's just, I just haven't been recording, so I just, I just, I simply don't know how to, how to do this. I forgot how to YouTuber. I forgot how to be a YouTuber. Shit's wild. But hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully you guys enjoy this just, uh, me rambling, talking about shit. Let me just squeeze past you here, ma'am. Pick up this item. Let me just squeeze past you. Oh, no, not go- Oh, son of a bitch! I noticed too late. Mudsdale takes too long to turn around his big, fat, stupid-ass horse. Uh, I can't say that about... About Mudsdale, though. I fucking love Mudsdale. Great Pokemon. I used him in, like, my first ever playthrough of Alola. And he put in crazy work. So. I can't be too upset. I can't be too upset. Hmm. Actually, I really want to talk about the 200 subscribers special, and since, you know, since I'm here, I might as well. Um, it's going to be, I just really want to talk about it. I'm trying to find something to talk about, and like this is something I'm actually looking forward to and shit. Uh, it's going to be a hardcore Nuzlocke of Renegade Platinum. That is my plan for the 200 subscriber special series. I know it's not like anything you guys specifically asked for or anything like that. But it's something that's very hard, and I've been wanting to do for a while. I've been wanting to play, like, a challenge ROM hack for, like, a while with a Hardcore Nuzlocke rule set, just because, you know, I want to see if I really got that dog in me, you know? 
I want to really see if I got it in me to, to hardcore Nuzlocke uh, Drayano hack. So, that'll be the, the 200 subscriber special. I'm, I'm proud to announce that. And then, I'm hoping I can get like a two-piece of the content. Oh, this is going to do some damage. God, that does some damage. Fucking retaliate, man. Um, I hope I can two-piece this content, because, first of all, I'm going to get like, you know, a lot of episodes out of it, depending on how long it goes for and how like edited I want it to be and shit like that. But also, if you know the YouTuber streamer, Ludwig, uh, you'll know he also did... He didn't do a hardcore Nuzlocke. I believe he was allowed to use items in battle. If I remember correctly. But he did a Nuzlocke of Renegade Platinum. And he did not like, uh, like 15 tries or something. And I was like, surely it's not that hard. So, my first idea was, okay, I'll do the same thing. But I'll do it with only shiny Pokemon to make it even more challenging on myself for absolutely no reason. And then I tried shiny hunting in that game, and there are raised odds. It's like 1 in 512 or something. And I'm like, this just takes too long. I I would like to do this for content, but I simply do not have the the patience to to do that. So I was like, fuck it. And just put it on the back burner. I literally have a thumbnail made from like probably like the day after the video came out, which I think was like September 2021, so nearly a year. And I just, I just been sitting on that idea because I just never wanted to start on it. So maybe I'll just do it this way. I'll just do a hardcore Nuzlocke, like, which is harder than what he did, and in less tries. Uh, so that's, that's basically my plan. So I'm, tr I'm gonna hopefully two-piece this content and get like 30 videos out of it for the series. And then one, like, more edited together, like, Pokemon Challenge run that I normally do. Um, and, like, clickbait Ludwig's name in the title and shit. And then become famous. And that'll, that'll simply be my, my rise to stardom. That's my plan, at least. Uh, whether or not it works is something else, but that's more or less the plan. Then I just really like Renegade Platinum. I think it's uh, a really good... ROM hack. And, yeah, that's about it. That's about all I have for the, uh, the whole idea behind this 200 subscriber special. Other than that, like, I don't really know what else I could do, because I could do, like, an egg lock or something, and have you guys send in eggs, but I might for, like, you know, like, the next 100, uh, milestone or something. But I think for this one, I definitely want to commit to a hardcore Nuzlocke of Renegade Platinum. And I'm already thinking about it. I was already thinking about, like, the encounters and, like, what I need for, like, the gyms. Because I've played through Renegade Platinum a couple times. So now I'm just, I'm sitting on, like, what to do. I'm already, I'm basically already sweating it. Which, uh... I have been accused of being a sweaty tryhard before, and this time the I'm not beating that accusation. I'm not beating the sweaty tryhard accusations. Accusations, not accusations. But yeah, that's that's the plan for the 200 sub special. Uh, but with all that being said, you know we're at the 25 minute mark. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and end the episode here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, I really appreciate it. Sorry that. You know, I'm just like all over the place every episode and don't know how to commentate and have hardware issues, but you know what it is. I mean, if you're subscribed, then, you know, this is what you signed up for, so it's your fault, really. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you for 200 subscribers, and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.